In biliary tract cancers to date, we have so far the positive data with Topaz, which is Gemsys plus Dravalumab. That was certainly exciting and I think is definitely one avenue for understanding how immunotherapy can be effective, maybe in combination with a cytotoxic chemotherapy backbone. We're still awaiting the data from Keynote 966, which will be Gemcitabine, Cisplatin, and Pembrolizumab. And at this meeting, we're gonna see the data from Gemcitabine, Cisplatin, and Atezolizumab with Bevacizumab. So there's a lot of work happening in the chemotherapy plus immunotherapy space. But I think the other obvious space in terms of understanding immune resistance is going to be dual targeting. Now, whether that be the obvious anti-CTLA-4 and PD-1 versus some of the newer compounds that are being looked at, like in lag 4 Tigit, et cetera. Uh, and I think there's a lot of work happening both in the preclinical space to really better understand the immune microenvironment of biliary cancers, as well as kind of early data looking at phase one, phase two trials with these combinations.